Hi guys, happy Sunday. Just uh, sitting down, it's planning day. Sunday is planning day, but this week coming up is insanely busy uh, in our family. And yeah, it's gonna be a tough one. But as I say, uh, tough doesn't mean impossible. So what I had to do this week when I was planning, rather than just sit down and go, okay, these are the meals we're having, these are the groceries we need, these are the nights we're gonna have them. I really needed to map out some super fine tuning to, to make, to, even down to the letter of, okay, I need to put the slow cooker on on Monday morning for this night and get it all mapped out. So I had to sit down and this was, probably can't see it, but this was all the meals that we're having. We needed the cake cooked for the week so it can go into the lunch boxes, the lunch, we needed all the meals. Um, we needed the custard made because we're also trying to do no plastics, yeah? Um, but then I also needed to map in work because I've got a three-day conference at the back end of the week. So it's looking pretty busy. So I had to go, okay, here's what it looks like. Also, I had to map in that it's super important to me that I get quality time with the kids over the week, even though it's going to be crazy, crazy busy and I don't want to feel like we're just constantly rushing from thing to thing and we don't get time to check in and, and just hang out and chat and play. So I've mapped it all out, um, literally saying, okay, tonight I've got to make the chocolate cake and the lamb stew. Once the kids go to bed, I've got to sit down and do a, do a few emails. Um, tomorrow I've got to make sure the slow cook goes on first thing. I've got to walk the kids to school, make sure I walk the dog or the dog's not going to get a walk. Then I've got to go um, and get a whole bunch of work done and literally everything's planned in 30 minute increments. So we must uh, stay on time during the work day to all of those increments. Then when we get home, cooking dinner and also just making sure tomorrow night is the only night where we'll get to sit down and just have family movie nights. So we're going to do that tomorrow night. But I guess my point in this, and um, I'll put a photo of this little map up as well, but the point to it is that, yeah, we're busy. You know, I'm, I'm a single mum. I run a business. I've got six staff. I've got uh, two kids, and this week I'm at a three-day conference. So things do get pretty, pretty busy. But we can make this work if we are super organized. So, you know, some weeks I'm not organized, some weeks it, it just doesn't work and I don't juggle all the balls. But this week I'm pretty confident that I've got it all mapped out. I know what I've got to do that, you know, I can block out those times so that I still do get time to stop and just be mindful and hang out with my kids and enjoy the things that are also equally as important to me. So yeah, guys, um, the way I did it was I just did a mind map of everything that needed doing this week. I put it all into the planner. And then, you know, I looked at some days and went, that's just too busy. If we do that much on that day, everybody's just gonna be ratty. So I had to cross a few things out. So get really clear on what your priorities are. Get really clear on what's important. Get really clear on, on what's what needs doing and also what's gonna propel you toward your goals or the things that you're working on. And for everybody that's different. Um, so yeah, I hope that helps some people just to, just to get a little bit focused, to map it out and yeah, have a great day. I am now going to